Thomas Seawood, Kwakwakiwak Cree artist. This is a Douglas fir hollowed out like a vase, has uh, wood the bottom solid, so it's just like a vase. And it measures two feet high by five and a half inches wide. It was made by the late master lathe turner, wood turner, Bill Lucier, last name L U C E. Definitely Google his name, Bill Lucie, and hit images on Google, and you'll see a lot of the bowls that he did. He was a uh, master, and his work was well sought after by uh, collectors, and I have about a thousand of his bowls, and about 75 of these tubes, ranging from one foot high right up to about six feet, and some of them are hollow where they don't have a wood bottom. Others like this one are just like a glass vase would be. I painted two Kwakwakiwak designed hummingbirds on it. Uh, it's a commissioned piece and the person that asked me to do this, they wanted red flowers instead of uh, cherry blossoms like I usually do. But I also do camas flowers with the hummingbirds. But it's a beautiful vase. Uh, I would recommend uh, putting uh, the florist sponge inside and picking up some imitation cherry blossoms you can order online some high-end ones or other flowers like the red ones I painted and put it in there and this one was definitely gonna be a conversation piece in their home they've ordered three bowls off me altogether I delivered another one and this one will be going off hopefully in the next couple of days but I just thought I'd show it to you and I'll zoom in a bit just so you can see the hummingbirds a little better If you're interested in one of my pieces, uh, like I said, I have over a thousand bowls. You can contact me by email tom.seawid at gmail.com, T-O-M dot S-E-W-I-D at gmail.com. And I'd be happy to send you pictures of the different shapes and sizes of bowls and different woods that I have. And uh, you pick your design and I'll paint it on there for you.